This is Don Dollars for Don Dollars TV, and I would like to give some advice to all of the present and future racist parents around the world. This is not just about black and white. I'm using this picture as an example. The young lady that you see in this picture is the daughter of former NBA owner Donald Sterling, who was a known racist. And what I've noticed, including this case, is that over 52 years of my life, I've seen the children of races end up in the arms of the very people that they were hating. And when you raise children, whether you're black, white, Indian, Mexican, whatever it may be, and you are racist against other races, it usually drives your children into the arms of the very people that you are hating. And I repeated that twice because a lot of people don't understand this. And your children, whether it be a female or a male, ending up in the arms of the people that you hate is one of your worst nightmares. If you really hate another race, you will hate seeing your child in the arms of that race. And this is very simple to understand. What's most important in life is treating people like we want to be treated. And that includes your children. And trying to force your rhetoric and your ideology and your feelings about other people and other races onto your children is only going to backfire most of the time. So this is my advice. However you feel about people from other races, okay, that's how you feel. But when you force this upon your children, it may cause you to come to your worst nightmare, which is your child being in the arms of the people that you hate. And if you're listening to this, like I said, whether you're black, white, Mexican, or from any other race or culture around the world, be careful of how you try to force your thinking upon your children because your worst nightmare just might come true. Until next time, y'all take care and be safe.